It's like, I know, I think I got beef. I think I have another one that's beef. I don't know why. Cause I literally normally get beef for the benefit, not chicken, but whatever. That's actually maybe why I don't like it so much. Every move is on the page. Maybe. Fourteen hundred. Behave. To find a way to change. I had to leave to find my way. Got up in a daydream. I've been lost a bit since when? I've been safely. It's how I understand what I want. I'm gonna have since last year, but I haven't been on here for very long, like a couple days. Success is a finicky thing, and if you ain't sure, no, it'll never be. I don't wanna let myself down, myself. Yeah. Oh, I honestly don't know what my pictures are. But yeah, probably. Okay, girly, girly. Bye. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> my water tastes really good. I put a liquid IV in it. Now it tastes like sherbet. Thank you. Uh, do I look fat in my pictures? I'm kidding. 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 Oh, this is just so bad. Like, I don't think I can. Microplastic? Well, I don't want to drink the tap water because it's gross here. But I don't not believe you. I very much believe you. <laughs> Bullshit! Yeah, I'm probably not going to, but I also don't want to waste it. So I might like freeze it and then use it in something. <laughs> Dang, I have to brush my hair. I grew up in a place. Okay, well, but the water here. Told you how to run the race. Uh, move is on the pace. Uh, uh, uh. But I didn't like yeah. the way. Had to fight to behave. Had to find like, a way to change. It literally, I don't know. To find my way. But what about those you jugs that you put in the thing? And then you like, you know what I'm talking about? Safely. It's how I understand what I want in this place. Because everybody wanted to do bad things. Like, the big ones? Is that bad? Success is a finicky thing. And if you ain't sure, no, it'll never be. I don't want to let myself down, myself down. I don't know. I was thinking about getting one of those and just getting like a service, wa like water service to my door. Mm. I'm not sure. I have no idea actually. Um, no, I had something else. I had eggs for breakfast. But I woke up late, so like pretty much, pretty much lunch, because I woke up and I got out of, well, I woke up early, but I got out of, out of bed late. Like really late. Bye. Hey, here's crazy. Bye. Thanks for saying bye. So kind. So considerate. Bye. <laughs> oh, it's silly. It's so silly. Seven o'clock. Oh, that's right. I'm sorry. I did two. I literally told my friends I would go to the liquor store. And I can't. Unless. Okay, I'm just thinking out loud. <laughs> Never mind.
I might have some cash. Because beatboxes are like, what? $5? Yeah. <laughs> so I can like scrap up some cash probably. <laughs> yeah. Wow. You how to run the race. Every move is on the page. But I didn't like their way. Had to fight and misbehave. Had to find a way to change. Had to leave to find my way. Got up in a daydream. I beat my mind up here almost daily. It's how I pass time. No I need one and a half beatboxes. Let me some beatboxes. Let me some beatboxes. Success is a finicky thing. And if you ain't sure, no, it'll never be. Because weirdly enough, you don't give me hangovers. Like, I black out and I won't have a hangover. So weird. I don't know why. I mean, like, I'll feel kind of gross, but, like, I'm not over the toilet all day. Because I've had some, literally, I go to the bar, like, last, not even a year ago, I went to the bar, and I feel like I didn't get, like, I don't know, like, I don't think I, I blacked out, like, a tiny bit, but overall, I was pretty well behaved. And that was the worst hangover of my life. I genuinely thought I was going to have to go get my stomach pumped. Like, I could not keep anything down until midnight. Like, are you kidding me? That was Like, I genuinely was, like, my parents were concerned because I was visiting home. It was pretty bad. I don't know what I like drank it. I'm like, fuck, this is what happened. Because I don't really think I got that fucked up, but I guess I did. And then there was one time I literally was working and I had a layover uh, in my hometown on Christmas. And I have a problem where I don't know when to go home. And I didn't know when to go home and I went out way too late. And I was really sick working the next day. That was really bad, but I didn't throw up. I just felt horrible, horrible. Just literally so bad. But I had fun with my family on Christmas and then I was working too, so I was being paid. That's nice, I guess. <laughs> just drinking so much. My I think because I went to my family Christmas and then I took my friend that I was working with on the trip with to the bars in my hometown. And then my dad was paying for all of our drinks and I was just like, let's get a shot. Shot after shot after shot. And I was like, okay, time to go home. And I literally met that girl that day. And I was like, you're coming to my family Christmas.